Hey YouTube, Casual Yugi Stuff here, back bringing you guys another Yu-Gi-Oh! opening video. I am very, very late to the party, but finally, I will be opening my Battles of Legend Armageddon sealed booster box right here in this video, guys. So, this set came out a while ago now, a couple of months ago, I want to say. Um, maybe in July time, or maybe even earlier than that, maybe June, July, uh, earlier on in this year. Uh, I can't remember exactly, but obviously it's a 2020 set. It is an awesome set, and again, I had to open one of the boxes, so I have got one in for you guys. Um, you may be saying that um, casual, it's probably best to keep it sealed, because these have actually skyrocketed in price. They're a lot more expensive than they were when they came out. But hey, we're an opening channel, so we're going to enjoy the opening and search for the 10k dragon or utopia. I mean, out of one box, I don't think that's actually possible. Well, everything's possible, but we shall see. Guys, stay tuned for this one. It's going to be cool. Um, leave a like. Like, comment down below and you'll be entered in today's giveaway if you are a subscriber that is I'll be giving away a few cards we have a cyber barrier dragon winged Karibo level 10 and transcendent wings for those Yu-Gi-Oh GX fans the rares from the doors packs and a sealed battle pack uh, dawn epic dawn so sealed battle pack epic dawn uh, that's the giveaway prize for this uh, this video guys just leave a like be a subscriber and comment down below your favorite card from battles of legend my favorite card is time stream I'm looking forward to getting a few of uh, mr. What's his face? The Australian from Yu-Gi-Oh! GX. I don't know what his name will come. Is it Tim? Is it Tim? It is Tim, I think. <laughs> when you're on camera and you're recording, guys, you make several mistakes, and I tend to do that a lot, and I love how you guys... Uh, is it Tim? I don't know. Well, we've got to digress now. Anyway, so the opening will begin. Battles of Legend. Um, beautiful booster box. Uh, but yeah, when you're on camera, guys, you make insane mistakes, and I think I called Voltic... Uh, bicorn, volcanic bicorn in my one of my previous videos, which is quite funny, and uh, you guys loved it. So here we go, guys. Battles of Legend. We'll crack it open, searching for some epic pools. Right there, you go, guys. The box is open, and we are opening. I always double check to see that we hit the record button when I do open these boxes, because once we open it, there's no going back. Again, sealed collectors, do look away. It's that time of the video where we crack open some sealed products. Battles of Legend. Such a beautiful artwork. My favourite card is Time Stream. Um, out of this set, as I say. But I do like the dragons as well. Like Judgment Dragon of the Light. Uh, Dark Armed Dragon. And the uh, Chaos Emperor Dragon. So, Battles of Legend. Armageddon, guys. There we go. Our box has been opened. It's Jim, not Tim. It's Jim. See? I remembered. Is it Jim? Guys, my, as I say, when I'm on camera, I'm really camera shy so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 there's 24 packs in this yeah 24 packs we'll start off with the left hand side and we'll see what we can get i'm just looking to collect the cards out of here guys I'm not looking for any crazy well obviously a crazy pool would be nice oh so here we go we have a fossil warrior skull knight that's perfect one of uh, one of the main characters cards assault blackwing penguin torpedo and quacky mary draco draco which we also packed from raging battle recently so the hollows are at the front, guys. So we'll try and open them back to front first, so we don't surprise. We don't obviously. If we do get a good pull, don't want to reveal it. Oh, fossil fusion! Nice. So beautiful card. Another one of Mr. Jim's cards. Classic. Guys, I'm probably gonna embarrass myself if it's not Jim. I'm pretty sure it is Jim, but just to be sure, guys, really. Really need to look into that. Fossil Warrior Skull Bones. We're getting a lot of the fossil cards, which is exactly what we came here for. Um, Sunlight, Wet, Sunlight Wolf, which is good. Um, yeah, the most expensive cards out of here, I think, is just Chaos Emperor Dragon. But even that card's gone down in price massively. Um, very exciting and fun to open this. Let's keep going, guys. So far, so good. We have got a few cards that we've wanted. But can we get a Utopia or a... Beautiful 10k dragon, I doubt it, but here we go. A specimen inspection, another one of his cards. Cool. Number three, Gaia Defender, number 59, and uh, Afterglow. Such a fun set to open this. Let's see if we can get out of this one, guys. A Glacial Beast Blizzard Wolf, nice. I'm, I'm hunting for those dragons as well, just because of the fact that. Um, they do look really cool in Secret Rare. I know they came out as jump promos, and I do have a couple of them. But um, we're really looking for those uh, as well in this video, for sure. Oh, Elemental Hero Chaos Neos, that's cool. 
Got our secret rare down there. Let's just make some room. I think you can see those. The lighting's pretty terrible, guys, in this video. Hmm. Bear with me one second, guys. Let me just move that lighting out of the way. That should be a bit better for you, I think. Hmm. Maybe not. Maybe just turn off this light. My bad, guys. Is that better? Yeah, probably better. Okay. So, sorry about that. Move on to the opening. As you weren't able to see the pools very well. Okay, guys. So, we have... Quite difficult to open these packs. A Trishula! Nice. The Dragon of Imprisonment. Sweet. Very, very cool card. Now, Elemental Hero, Shining Fairly Man. Why they did not reprint Elemental Hero Anios in this set is beyond me. That card still is yet to be reprinted. Hey, here we go. Dragon, Dragon, Dark, sorry, Darkness Metal, the Dragon Dark Steel. So nice. Very nice secret. A few links there and a Blackwing uh, Curious, the Crack of Dawn. Four more packs from the left hand side, guys. Ugh. Fossil Warrior Skull Knight. Very nice pull. A couple of Ixies here. And number four. So we're going to get a lot of bulk out of this, guys. But it is still very exciting nonetheless. What's the best way to open these packs without them being damaged? It's not really working how we're opening these. It's kind of frustrating, really. Fossil Dragon Skull Gaios. Cool. Very nice. Ooh, it's getting hot in here, guys. It's getting very hot in here. Let's just make some space for our pools. Now, what, I think I might put the pools further up and turn that light back on, just because the foils aren't really gl glistening through, really. I need to sort out my lighting, guys. That's something on my to-do list for my channel. I seriously need to upgrade the lighting because it's so inconsistent in all my videos, and I want you to enjoy the pools with the best lighting possible so we'll see if I can look into that glacial beast uh, iceberg narwhal that's cool uh, I want a hero and invoke glacier last pack of the left hand side Let's see what we can get Ooh, here we go. Number C92, Chaos 92, Heart Earth Chaos Dragon. That's a cool one. Very cool. I like Heart Earth Dragon. It's a really nice ghost rare from um, Cosmo Blader. So down to the last, uh, well, the second hand side, the right hand side of the box. Let's see if we can get a time stream, guys. Fossil Dragon Skalgar. Nice. Cool. Sweet. Let's keep going. Let's see what we can get out of this box, guys. Where's the Judgment Dragon of Heaven? That's what I want to get next. Ooh, hello. A high right, high rate to draw. High rate to draw. Cool. Where is our 10k dragon? Where is our Utopia? To be fair, I'd prefer to pack a Utopia than, ten, than 10k dragon. Just because I'm a massive fan of Yu-Gi-Oh's Exile. And 10k dragon, I think, is one of the most overrated cards out there. Especially for the fact that it is... Um, you know, quite overrated, in my opinion. I think it shouldn't be worth the money it is worth. But hey ho, armored white bear. Uh, nothing out of that one. Unfortunate, but we keep going. We have still got some packs to go. Another fusion here. It's elemental hero Escudario. Escurido. Yeah. Neos alias and Ra's disciple. Ra's disciple could be going up now that. Wing Dragon of Ra Ghost Rare is on the horizon. Numeron Network. I will be opening some... Oh, that's a cool card. Make a Phantom Beast O-Line. I remember when this was so expensive from Primal Origin, but in this reprint, it definitely damaged the cost of the card. Yeah, Rage of Ra, guys. I will be opening that pretty much uh, this week. So stay tuned for a video either up uploaded on Friday or Saturday. I'm hooking up with Sleeping Dragon Gaming. Medolce Angeli. Nice. Cool. Some more black wings, malefic, and a, a plancer cephalopus. So yeah, rage of raw guys. Are we gonna pull out of a case a ghost rare raw? I don't know what the drop ratios are for that card, but um, I've heard it's uh, it's one every case. Numeron calling. That's cool with Jinzo on there. Psychic wave. Very very cool card. Uh, invoked. We still haven't got a time stream, guys. Can we out of our last packs pull a time stream? 
That is what I'm going for. Hey, Danger Jackalope. That's a cool card. Very nice. Run those in my Light Swan. I actually needed one of those. I forgot that came in the set. Excellent stuff. Right, I run Chaos Light Swan. Here we go. We've got a spell card. Is it Time Stream? Oh, it's Artifact Ignition. Oh, it's not a Time Stream, guys. We've still got a few more packs to go. Can we get something epic? Maybe even a Chaos Emperor Dragon. We got a Judgment Dragon of Heaven. I will take that. Massive Light Swan fan. Beautiful to see an alternate artwork for the Judgment Dragon. Well, a different card. Um, but still very nice. We've got two more packs, guys. Two more packs left. We'll save the Chaos Emperor Dragon one till last. We'll crack over the Red Eyes Darkness Metal Dragon. Which we pulled a Powered Crawler. Secret Rare. Last pack of magic, guys. Can we pull something epic? Do you know what we haven't done? We haven't done a pack whiff. Let's give this pack a little whiff. Ooh. Hmm, not really a smell there. Smells like uh, 2020, and 2020 has not been a good year for anyone, so <laughs> it's not a smell I want to remember. Should we do the pack trick for this pack, guys? Yeah, we may as well. Alright, guys, so Necros of Gungir, Book of Moon, and a number C1. Number Chaos number number one. Not too bad at all, guys. So we were kind of hard done by from our box. I think we did okay, but not amazing. We didn't get any Chaos Emperor Dragons. I think value-wise, we definitely missed out. But collectability, we did really, really good, guys. Uh, that was a really fun opening. We did get some cool cards. Danger Jackalope, I do like, um, as well as all of our fossil cards. I think we got all the fossil fusions, did we? Um, bear with me. Did we get all the fossil fusions? I think we did. I think we got all five fossil fusions, guys. Correct me if I'm wrong, but we got a lot of those fossil cards, which is good. That's exactly why we came here. And is it Jim or is it Tim? I'm going to stick with Jim. Jim from Yu-Gi-Oh! Uh, GX, guys. Again, when you're on camera, you can never remember. But guys, this was casual Yu-Gi-Oh! stuff with a blah opening. A booster box of blah. Uh, very fun to open. I'm happy that I can say I've opened one of these boxes now. Subscribe for more epic Yu-Gi-Oh! content. Really, really good stuff, guys. I'm about to record another video. Um, of course, the same day recording. But it's going to be exciting. Stay cool, everybody, and keep it casual, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye for now, and peace. Come on, let's go! It's too close to the